What is up guys, we are back with some more Pokemon Sword and we're here in Hammerlock Town. Um, and we're getting into this cutscene with Leon, I guess. Blade, seems you're doing well collecting gym badges. But Hop, did something happen with him? He was acting really odd when I ran into him. He took one look at me and immediately was like, I'm so sorry, Lee. It might be the first time I've heard him apologize for anything and I have no idea what it was for. Maybe he's feeling down because he had some hard losses in battle? Uh, yeah, he lost to that person. When you lose, you feel down in the dumps, but then there's nowhere left to go but up. You've got to think on why it was you lost though. You know, that little brother of mine, I think he might yet become a surprisingly great trainer. Blast, and look at the time. Nearly forgot my meeting with the chairman that Alina really lets me hear it when I'm late. Now, if only I could remember which way to go. I'd say that you should go and say hello to Raihan while you're here, Blades. He's the greatest rival I've got, and the final hurdle you'll have to face in the gym challenge. He should still be around the vault if you hurry down. If you hurry, it's down that way on the Route 6. On the way to Route 6. Wow, I need, I'm tripping today. Up, oh, and we got the store for new clothes. Faded sweatshirt. Well, let's look at the hoodies. I don't know, guys. I'm a big fan of blue, but I'm also like a really more so a big fan of the lighter blue. I think I like that shade better. I'm out here just pimping my guy out like, like nothing. Dang, the shoes are just really whack. Oh man, I want to go on those. Oh, I could change up my hairstyle. That kind of I do want to do. Oh wow, why did I say makeup? Lavender ice. Oh snap. Okay, my guy looks. He looks kind of grimish. I don't know. I guess we'll go with that. <laughs> my guy looks like he's been through some stuff. I'm not gonna lie. He does look like he's been through some stuff.
I don't know how he's gonna look, but I don't know. I just really wasn't feeling the the Caesar cut. All right, cool. Let's get back to our journey. Hyper potions, okay. Wasn't expecting that. Okay, I was kind of expecting someone to be in here for a trade or something, but it doesn't look like there are. Oh, they're having a battle. I choose you. <laughs> squishy, squish, squishy, squish. Oh, who are you? Oh, you're the dragon uh, gym leader. Oh, if it isn't the trainer endorsed by the champion. Let's see, what was your name again? Ah, right, Blades. And if Leon himself recognized your potential, then I guess you'll grow into quite the trainer. All the same, though, anyone wanting to challenge the mighty Raihan has to prove they're up to it by earning seven gym badges first. Ah, so you're here to see our treasures, are you? Getting a better understanding of Pokemon by studying history certainly isn't a bad idea. I like your spirit, kid. Follow me, why don't you? I mean, okay. I'll even spare you one of the League cards. Okay, bro. Now on you go. If it's the vault you want, it's up those stairs there. Well, looks like I got permission to go. I was just clicking, I, I didn't expect that to be there. <laughs> I don't know, can I get a lucky click again? No? Okay. Ah, Sonya's here. Oh, you're here. Brilliant, aren't they? It's great that there are still treasure tapestries that can tell us of the Galler's history. The two of you watching a wishing star. A disaster occurs. The two bewildered youths. The youths looking on at the sword and shield that stopped the disaster. The youths being crowned. These tapestries tell the story of the creation of the kingdom of Galar. Say, young Jim Challenger, what sticks out to you most about them? Two heroes. Bang on, the statue at the hotel on Motostoke only had one hero. No matter how you slice it, but here we clearly have two youths. Was there really only one hero, or were there two? And what even caused the darkest day? Thanks for letting me bounce some ideas off you. I think I've got some theories now. I'm going to research the tapestries a tad more, but you have your gym challenge, right? I'm cheering for you, so take a couple of these. I hope to see more of your wins. I feel like there should have been more to coming in here. Maybe I'm just nitpicking. The tapestries in the vault depict the heroes of the Galar's region's past. I suppose if we got any modern hero, it'd have to be our champion, Leon. Listen up, Blades. Your goal is to defeat the superstar, Leon. So go conquer Route 6 and train yourself up along the way to Stow on side. Sir, yes sir? Oh, if anybody's wondering what my team is looking like, I have Thwacky at level 32, Toxel's 29, Hatena, because I want to 
see the evolutions for Hatena, and it's a psychic type. I need a psychic type. We got Dreadnought, who's still going to get replaced later on, and then Corvus Squire and Carcoal. Oh, you headed to Stow on side, Jim Challenger? Everyone knows that Route 6 leads on to that good old town. Everyone? Oh, did you guys finish your battle? No. Oh, there's more. Another person. Toxa are so cool. I really, really want one. If you got a Toxa, would you please trade it for my Togepi? No. Actually, where do you even catch Toxels? That's one thing I didn't even think about. I don't even know where it would be when it came to the Pokédex. Oh, but we got Hatena there. Well, I'm not going to trade the one I have now, but these are like all the different locations I could have got one, but I didn't see a single one. So that's kind of interesting to me. So maybe they're rare to get in general, like she was saying. Why is he just down here creepily? Like, bro, like, go out somewhere where there's more light. What is, what is that? What a cute silicobra. Just look at those adorable eyes. It's our duty as Team Yell to make sure Silicobra gets a nice peaceful sleep. Hello there. If I promise not to wake the Pokemon, will you let me through? Of course, it'd be our pleasure. What type is that, though? Poison what? Oh, hey, Blades. You're heading to Stow on side, right? Oi. Team Yell, don't suppose you'll let us through. Nah, you kids are way too loud, can't be letting you through. And we're particularly not fond of kids wearing the challenge band. With all your stomping around, so the Cobra is sure to wake up. Right. What do you say, Blades? If we don't get past them, we won't be able to continue our gym challenge at the Stow on side. I'll battle them. Yeah. Are you? Yeah, that's the spirit. You two are way too noisy. You don't want to wake up Silicobra now, do you? I swear, kids these days. Well, we've got no choice. We have to send you packing. It's for all the sake of Silicobra. Okay, yeah, I think my character definitely looks way cooler now. I didn't even think about how that matchup was going to be. Are you still going to use faint? Okay. I mean, it's not going to work in your favor.
I need to learn a ground type move now that I think about it. Okay, car call level 32. Dang, poison did a lot. Uh, we're gonna switch him out and just let Kawaki go out again. Okay, I was not expecting that to do all that damage. Okay, sweet. He missed. <laughs> Even your battles are too noisy. Am I about to battle the other one now? I think I'll leave the steel blades. Keep up the pace. Oh wow, he really doesn't want to battle. I need ground and I need fighting types. Oh, uh, why'd you have to be such a bother? Can you at least heal up my Pokemon hop? Silicobra might wake up after all that ruckus. Then there's no point in us sticking around. Let's get out of here. We'll make these bothersome kids holler some other day. They really have a rag with like Marnie's face on it. Blades, you and Thwacky were brilliant together. See, Bead really wiped the floor at me the last time we battled. And don't get me wrong, I can take a loss. Battling means you've got to lose sometimes. But he said that I was dragging Lee's good name through the mud, being so rubbish like I was. And I just can't get those words out of my head. If I'm weak, then people will think Lee is weak too. But I don't want that. I can't let Lee get dragged down. He's the unbeatable champion. I'm going to have to take some time figuring this out. See you around, Blades. Dang, he's really down in the dumps. You're one of the gym challengers endorsed by Leon, aren't you? Okay, you just came out of nowhere. My name's Opal. If you want to know more, have a look at my league card. I'll keep an eye on you, child. I want to see what you can do when you go all out. Okay, Grandma. At least we're on to a new route. I thought I thought he would at least heal up my team, but he didn't. He's trash for that. Let's 
Let's see what Pokemon you have then. So if you say it's super cute. Luckily, Quacky's a girl, so we won't have to worry about um, infatuation. Wow, use metronome and you got a grass move to use on me? That's bad luck. Don't be ice for fire, and you would get fire. I think poison's good against fairy, last I checked. But maybe this wasn't the perfect matchup to do. Let's oh, that's a Is that grass for fighting? I don't know. Thing. All she's gonna do is use metronome. Okay, yeah, we're switching you out. And I guess we'll just have Carcoal come out. Slip away, my guy. Gear grind. That's actually a nice move. Tox will hit level 30. Oh, snap, and he's evolving. Okay. Toxtricity. So, one thing I looked up for uh, Toxtricity is that there's two forms for Toxel's evolution. Capable of generating 15,000 volts of electricity, this Pokemon looks down on all that would challenge it. So there's like an amped up mode, and then there's like a chill mode, I guess? Which is basically what mine is. Mine's in like that chill, relaxed mode because of its nature. So its evolution is based off its nature that you get. And since mine is timid, it's more relaxed and introverted. So it's kind of like introverted and extroverted forms in a sense. 
But guys, um, with that evolution, I'm going to leave off the episode right here. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like for the video. It helps out the video a lot. And also subscribe to my channel. It helps out the channel a lot. And with that said, stay sharp. Later.